The family of Matthew Perry discusses the arrests related to his ketamine-related death, following the criminal charges against five individuals in relation to the 54-year-old friend star's death in October of last year. Matthew Perry's family has made their voice known, according to a statement the Morrison family provided to USA Today on Thursday, we were and still are heartbroken by Matthew's death, but it has helped to know law enforcement has taken his case very seriously. We're appreciative of the tremendous job done by the agents from several agencies that looked into Matthew's death, and we hope that justice will eventually be served. We're hoping that dishonest manufacturers of harmful medications will take notice. Perry's stepfather is longtime Dateline correspondent Keith Morrison. He wed Matthew Perry's mother, Suzanne Perry, in Morrison previously shared in a March episode of the Making Space with Hoda Kotb podcast that Perry's loss is not easy, especially for his mom, Suzanne. As other people have told me hundreds of times, it doesn't go away. It's with you every day. It's with you all the time, and there's some new aspect of it that assaults your brain," Morrison told Kotby. Towards the end of his life, they were closer than I'd seen them for decades, texting each other constantly and sharing things with her that most middle-aged men don't share with their mothers," Morrison added. He was happy, and he said so. And he hadn't said that for a long time, and so that is a source of comfort, but also, he didn't get to have his third act. And that's not fair.